I'm Paul Donahue, and today we're talking about the industry's most urgent new regulation, the anti-money laundering rule, and your deadline is August 13th. Since 1970, the Bank's Secrecy Act has required banks and other depository lenders to have policies in place that would detect activities that could indicate money laundering schemes designed to filter cash from criminal activities and then integrate these ill-gotten gains into legitimate funds. The IRS and the Treasury Department has known for some time that mortgage loans are being used effectively to launder money. In April of 2012, the governing body over the Bank Secrecy Act, known as the Financial Crimes Enforcement Network, FinCEN, amended the anti-money laundering rules to now include non-bank residential mortgage lenders and originators. As of August 13, 2012, all mortgage brokers and all mortgage lenders must have their AML policies and procedures both written and implemented. Click on the link below that will take you to a revealing free interview that explains what the AML rule is and what your company must do right now. I want to give you fair warning though. This interview with Jonathan Fox of Lenders Compliance Group is hard hitting. However, it covers some very dry and complex issues concerning your immediate responsibilities. You may want to forward this interview to your branch managers, your owner, and your compliance officers at your company. Now move quickly, your time is short. The new AML rule is complicated and you and your colleagues need to understand what it all means to you. So click on the AML link, carve out 90 minutes, and brace yourself. The new anti-money laundering requirements are here and now. And do me a favor, would you? Spread the word for us, share this, Pass it along. This free interview can go out to your friends and we'll see you on the high road.